Hello my loves, welcome to my channel if you're new around here. My name is Jess and if you're not new around here, welcome back sweetheart. It's a joy to have your face back here again. I'm really excited for today's video because I have been compiling items of clothing from a few charity shops over a fair amount of months and I finally have enough to put it together in a video and showcase you what my little thrifty wifty hauls have been recently. I'm a massive fan of charity shopping. I do it every now and then, maybe at least once a month, I'd like to say. The first thing I'm going to show you is this blue Adidas skirt. This is actually the only thing out of all of the items that I actually got on Depop so not technically thrift shopping slash charity sh I always feel like an actual sellout when I say the word thrift instead of charity shopping because we do not use the term thrifting here in the UK we say charity shop so every time I say thrift I feel like an absolute sellout it's just easier to say thrifted charity shopped do you know what I mean it's second hand that's all that fucking matters now when I saw it on Depop I loved it in real life the blue is a bit of a different hue of the blue that I was hoping for. But I do like this skirt. It does look cute on, however, it doesn't fit me as nice as I was hoping. I don't know though if I am gonna keep it. So if you want it, make me an offer. <laughs> I most recently actually got this, just a plain white t-shirt. You know, sometimes you just need a plain white oversized t-shirt. And what I really like about it is that it's a drop shoulder. I love drop shoulder t-shirts. Like the sleeve, it drops. <laughs> it like, <laughs> instead of the the sleeve seam starting up here it actually like comes to here and it's really nice and actually these two are gonna go nicely together I haven't worn these together but I think these are actually gonna go quite nicely together so this is what you're gonna see me try on right now Guys, 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 guys. When I tell you, I have been wanting a leather trench coat for a long, long time. Long time. I just couldn't find the right one. I was gonna order one online, but all of the materials just looked like bin bags, you know? Just like, I didn't want a shit quality one and I didn't want to buy a real leather one. You know, I waited out and one day I was in a charity shop. Can you believe it? That's where I was, the charity shop. And I saw this jacket and I thought, Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Just stop. Just behave yourself. Um, it's not going to look that great right now on camera like this. I saw it in the shop and I was like, oh, should I get it? I tried it on. I even went to another charity shop and then came back and, you know, I gave myself time to think about it. It was 20 quid, but that was a lot. I've never spent 20 pounds in a charity shop yet. And it's real leather and it's kind of like, I don't, I don't know if I'm allowed to say vintage because I don't really know fucking anything about vintage. But what I do know is that I Googled it and um, to see what the price were of people selling it and people were selling it for like 60, 70, 90 so I was like, you know what, fuck it. Let me just buy it. And even if I don't get wear out of it and if I don't like it, I can sell it on and I'll definitely make some money off of it. But I haven't let it go yet. The, oh yeah, the biggest reason why I was umming and ahhing about getting it was because I wanted a long trench and this is more like half long. You know what I mean? But honestly, I love it and I have never looked back. And ah, uh, the outfit I'm about to show you is like actually, um, I can't believe that I have put this together. I can't believe that I've styled this because honestly, it's all gonna look so good together. I can't wait, I cannot wait to show you. Um, the next thing that I've got, I actually got this recently because I had to exchange a couple of other things in the charity shop that I had previously got, but I didn't actually like anymore. Um, so I exchanged it for this. And yes, you can return and exchange things in charity shops if you didn't know, because some people don't actually know that. This is really, really lovely. It's this top. And then it's got like these, these strap things that you can wrap around and tie and then the sleeves look like this and it's really, really lovely. It's actually got the original tag on from wherever it's from and it's just so lovely. But look, look, this is what I'm about to style it with. I'm actually really excited about this. I got this skirt. When did I get this? Quite a few months ago and I have never worn it out purely because, you know when you've got like a bit of a bigger bum, you know, you put on a skirt and at the front, it's the perfect length. But at the back, it's gone up by about 100 inches. And it's really sad because then it means I can't wear it out. So it's like sold me dreams. But it, oh, oh my God. Look at this. 
I honestly, I'm in love. I love it so much, but I will only be able to wear this out, yeah? If I'm wearing tights or if I'm wearing a jacket that's longer and covers. But now I've just realized actually maybe my styling idea is actually not so good because leather and leather, can you do that? Oh, Jiminy Cricket. I thought this was a great idea, a great outfit. It's fine, it's gonna look great, okay? It's gonna look absolutely great. And I've actually got shoes to complete the outfit. And I'm not normally a heels kind of girl, but there are some times in your old age where you need to mature. And there are certain events where it's actually nice to put on a little heel. And I got these shoes and I thought it would look really cute with this outfit. They aren't thrifted, but they are from the wonderful brand Vivea, who's sponsoring this part of the video. Vivea is a chic brand of footwear focusing on creating stylish and sustainable footwear that is more eco-friendly and responsible. All of the products are made using recycled materials and using 3D technology. And what I love is that each pair of shoes is the reincarnation of six plastic bottles that come from city waste and the ocean. All of the packaging is created using 100% recycled cardboard. So they kindly sent me two pairs of shoes. We have the Jade and we have the BB. So the Jade is a square toed heel, which is a perfect amount of heel which for me is a perfect heel because I honestly can't really do big heels so this is perfect and they will look really cute with jeans a skirt a dress anything like that and I feel like you can dress these up and dress these down I think these are an all-rounder really good sandal then we have the BB which is a really nice simple knotted detail flat for me I'd wear these if I needed to wear an outfit that was a bit more formal compared to what I'd usually wear BB styled with a knotted detail the BB is chic yet casual you will be wearing on repeat pair it with a flowy dress jeans or jumpsuit they have a natural amisha rg herbal insole with heel rebound arch and forefoot support they have a heel patch for added comfort and the rubber outsole is carbon free jade these square toe sandals are made from skin friendly yarn uppers and ultra soft and comfortable insoles you will feel like you're stepping on clouds the detailed texture on the upper creates an elegant look they are a perfect match with jeans and dresses and they have anti-slip rubber outsoles they are also antimicrobial and breathable thank you so much to vivea for sponsoring this part of the video feel free to go and check their instagram out to see a little bit more about them and how you can possibly style some vivea items use my code for a discount and check the link in the description to go and see their website and see what they're all about okay time to try on the outfit that i'm most excited about let's go The next thing I got was a dress. As soon as I saw it in the shop, I fell in love with it. It was honestly love at first sight. I am a sucker for a really nice floral print. I'm also a sucker for a nice long flowy dress with like a nice slit situation. However, this bloody dress is the size six. Honestly, I don't know what I was thinking. I do know what I was thinking actually, because I tried it on in the shop and it actually surprisingly fit, although it's quite tight. And there's a zip on the back and I actually have to have it unzipped a bit and like just fold over the top bit of the material where it zips. It works just fine. But I also was kidding myself. I keep getting things and telling myself, I'm gonna get a sewing machine and I'm gonna DIY the shit out of this and like make it like this upcycled invention that looks really beautiful. So I did tell myself that I was gonna make the bust i was gonna make a slit like a slit and make it a bit more you know low cut and i can still do that and that is why i'm still holding on to it still got the tag on this this dress was 5.99 oh my god it's actually a size four i don't know don't ask me honestly it's tight but it looks really lovely on just have a look My next purchase, I love it very, very much. It is honestly, it's so simple but effective. Here we have a sky blue bardo stretchy bodycon dress vibe. And I, I love it. It's just, this is like, this is the blue that I was hoping this skirt was gonna be. As you can see, I, what I mean, I wasn't hoping it's gonna be exactly this, but it's closer to this. I think I've got marks on it from when I folded it. 
Um, but yeah, I love this. I haven't worn this out yet. We've still got the tag on it. And this was a wonderful four pounds. I love this. It's just super comfy. Just, it's a very simple dress. And I feel like if I had fashion style and I knew how to fashion style, if I had styling um, skills, then I could probably style this with some something and make it look really cool. But I'm just not a fashion icon, unfortunately. <laughs> but it looks really, really lovely on. Go on, have a look. I know you want to. Okay, so the next thing I got, it's very hit and miss, okay? I saw it in the shop and I fell in love with it instantly. Everything about it, the pattern and the material. But I also knew in myself that there's a very big chance that I'm never gonna wear it. I just wanted it. And this is the problem with consumption. <laughs> it's this shirt. Honestly, past Jess would have definitely worn the shit out of this. I love it. The material is so, so nice. I just love the print. I don't even know what it is, but it's really cool. You know, it's just like really cool. And I was like, oh, I could be really cool in this and I could do something really cool. But uh, I, honestly, I think the problem is, is that I don't know how the fuck to style it. So please, please, please let me know down below how you think I just should style it because what I'm about to show you next is not me styling it very well at all. The next thing I got, I'm in love with. I love it. I love it so much. And this is one of those items when you see it in the charity shop, you have to fucking buy it. Because if you don't, you're gonna have regrets. You're gonna regret not buying it because it's a branded item. And also it's exactly what you've been looking for. This is exactly what I'd been looking for. A cropped Adidas top. I loved it. I loved it then and I love it now. I don't remember how much it was. It was definitely not more than a tenner. Probably about a fiver to be fair. But it's just one of those things that's like really simple but effective and it goes with so many things and I just love it. I thought that for the purpose of this video, I could wear it with this skirt that I bought from the charity shop. I don't know if it's gonna work. It probably isn't because I don't know how to style things and that's okay. But I got this with tags on, still on, and it was originally 30 pounds. But in the charity shop, do I still have the tag on it? No. But in the charity shop, I got it for about a five or I think. I just love myself a skirt and I love myself a tennis skirt and this one, the material was really nice. I just love it. Yeah, I loved it. I don't have anything quite like this. I do have another skirt that's like this pattern, but this one's got a brown in it. So like I needed to get it, you know? Let's just see what these look like together. Okay, this, oh, I don't, I keep thinking to myself and saying that this is my favorite, this is my favorite, but I think this is actually my favorite. I could not believe it when I saw this. I couldn't, I just couldn't believe my luck, honestly. Oh, 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 golly gosh, look at this. Oh my Lord, Bob. Now, if you know me, then you know that this is the most Jess dress you can probably get. No, it's probably not, but it's a very Jess dress and I love it. I'm so in love with like the, the milkmaid vibes. I'm in love with just like the cute, like girly frilly, like, Oh, I love it. And I love that it's got like slightly like puffy sleeves and I just think it's the most beautiful thing. And honestly, it looks, it just looks so good on. It looks so good on. I couldn't believe it when I saw this. Oh my God, you know what happened? There's actually, there was like a very, very slight stain on it. I think it was originally like, I think it was only like a five or something because it had a stain on it. You know, I said like, can I get a bit of money off? And he knocked off like three quid. So I got this for about two pounds. Honestly, beautiful. Oh, I love it. I love it so much. Okay, I know you want to see what it looks like on. Go on, feast your eyes on this.
I've been loving t-shirt dresses this summer vibe because I've been feeling super bloated and I just want to feel comfortable but loosey-goosey you know so I got a couple t-shirt dresses and then I wanted something that I could just like wear at home and so I got this when I tried it on in the shop I thought you know yeah I'll definitely wear this out but I can't lie I'm really just not like a stripes kind of gal so I definitely will never be wearing this out anywhere it's perfect for inside here's what it looks like on it's probably quite anticlimactic because I'm only gonna be wearing it inside but here we go Comment down below and let me know which outfit was your favorite. And also, please, 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 if there's any styling tips you can give me for any of these items, I would really appreciate it because your gal is lacking in the styling department, I must admit. You know, I make up for it in other departments, but you know, the styling department, not like as high in that area as I could be. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Go follow me on Instagram and TikTok at self acceptance of jess if you want to see more of what i'm doing more often i hope you enjoyed the video thumbs up subscribe have a wonderful day and a wonderful life and i'll see you back here very very soon much love peace